Hello boys and girls, my name is White Rhino PSO, and today I am playing some more Dungeon of the Endless. On the last floor, we ended up picking up, oddly enough, the Pyro from Team Fortress 2. And uh DV8 is now two-thirds of the way to being fully unlocked. Oh, I forgot to give anybody the industrial engine. Uh I'm gonna give him it just to find out. Speed uh, speed miles and carrying the crystal is reduced by 20%. Oh, when you pick up the crystal, um, you have your speed reduced. But when you're using the industrial engine, you, uh, you don't... It's 20% less effective on you. Now, it also lowers your speed by 8. So that's still a chunk of speed lost from what you would normally have. So I'm going to just keep it on... Uh, his speed's kind of low. Hmm. I'm going to keep it on the Butcher. Because I don't know if the Pyro would gain anything from it. Given that his, his damage comes from this special magical rainbow fire. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to keep it on Gorky. Now then... Open up a door and see if there's any dinosaurs. We get an item. And that item is the Gatling Gun. Uh, 24 attack power, lower to speed, and attack cooldown less. From the verb to gattle, meaning drill full of tiny exploding poisonous holes. Uh, he can use it. I believe he is the only one who can use it. So, he would gain more attack power and actually gain a speed and a DPS. Yeah, I'm going to switch out the Fuzi for the Gatling Gun. Which means now I have two weapons that I can't really use, but at least I didn't pay for one of them. Uh, power up this. I want more industry. And I will put in that and that. So you go there, and you go there. Ah, hell, everyone's go there. Yeah, Gorky is ridiculously slow now. If he's not already in the elevator when the crystal gets picked up, he's going to be left behind. Uh, I found a Stella. Estimated number of remaining turns three. Heal cost is times two. Hmm. Yeah, okay, this is like a sort of random effect thing. While this thing is alive, and it's only going to be alive for about three turns, the cost to heal is doubled. So yeah, instead of three, it's six for her now. Uh, so they can be, I think they can be good or bad, but right now that is just bad. And uh, self-powered room, so I don't have to worry about that one giving me issues. And I got some dust for it. Next up is actual enemies. Everybody back to the, the choke point. That's not what I meant. I'm not sure how much damage he's doing to other modules and such, if he is. That's a big room. With big enemies. Everybody back to the choke point. It does make for some somewhat boring gameplay when I keep just falling back all the time, but... Um... Is there anything else? Uh, I think I'm gonna make a food replicator. And then... put you and you... This will be my forward section. God, he's slow. And then, uh... 
Tear Gas Neurostun. So now, rather than falling all the way back, I'm just going to fall back to here and keep that guy working on the industry machine for now. I'm glad I didn't get two really slow guys to start. Already found the exit, and the exit is not a powered room, so I will power it. It looks like we finally hit a dead end, so I have to fall back all the way over here anyway. Ah, the hell with it. And get a free item. A dust box. Unlock secret compartment, defense of eight. Um, she can't use it. She can't. Him. I'll give it to him. What do I get? Plus 10% dust kept from a floor to another. Up to 20 and 20% 20 and 20 dust. Hmm. I guess... Oh, you, you lose a bunch of dust when you go from floor to floor, but you do keep some of it. I guess this just means you keep more when you do, which is pretty nice. Um... Oh, so down is the, uh... Ah, shit. Uh... Okay, I do have enough... Yeah, I've got enough power to power everything up there. Wow. That's pretty slow. So now it's time to explore this direction. Which is only really going to give me more rooms and items because I already know oh and science maybe uh, viral injector spreads disease uh, 22 hit points a second for eight seconds that's maybe a siblaster uh, oh the this module fires grenades but they harm everybody uh, dust generator, plus 30% defense to heroes in the same room, and NPCs in the, in the same room. Or oh, dust field generator, or food two. It's going to take three turns. I've got three doors, so I know I'll definitely get it. Uh, I'm going to go for food two, just because the more food I get, the more I can level people up. In fact, I think I'm going to level her up. Which will get me attack dog. 40% of the hero's attack power is shared with the tamed monster. That's pretty nice. That'll make him even better because uh, that means he'll have 25-ish. Probably closer to like 22 bonus attack power. Um, that is not power, but everything else is. Whoa. Oh. Hold on, I'll talk to you in a minute. Uh, bah, 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 bah. This could be bad. Or maybe not. Okay, so I think I made it through that one okay. But, I am going to defense up that and then put the two of them jamokes in there. And now I'm gonna see what's up with this guy. Um, so I can, he is the death deal. The dungeon is dark, but full of diamonds. So I can spend industry to get something unknown. Uh, or this ancient artifact is filled with sand that flows upwards in case of death break glass and inhale I don't know what the hell that means um I'm gonna roll the dice and I get tower of hats uh, unlocks bloody showman gives more defense and Bloody Showman is attack power plus four for monsters in the room, temporarily. Hmm. Wait, is it per monster? 
Oh, no. Uh, from monsters in the room. Huh. Max 30. So I guess it does count for everybody. Uh, I think I'm going to switch that up. Take that off him and put it on him because now he's got more attack power when there's monsters in the room which is good because he's like a defensive turret himself and well, what's the other things people have more experience with ex where's extenders Uh, heal cost is less. Ah, but that lowers the speed. I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna see how that works. So because of him, now there's... He's got the heal cost lessening. She's got the industrial engine. So her speed in itself is lower. Which is still pretty high. Um, yeah. So. Wow, there's a lot of doors over here, too. Um. No enemies over there. Yeah, that, that speed loss is kind of easy to feel. I might take that back off temporarily. We got food replicator two. I will mess with next turn. Everybody seems to be doing decently. doing like feng shui or something in there. Alright. Oh shit, I can do it more than once? I didn't know that. Uh, each kill heals up to 100 hit points distributed to heroes in the room. Oh, that's nice. I'm gonna try for that one. Can I try and squeeze out two? One, two. I got three doors. Uh. Hmm. That would be interesting. It's a portable shop, I guess. You you put it down, and then if a merchant like that death guy shows up, he will be placed in it, and you get dust based on that. Um, adds 15 in attack power to heroes in the same room. Uh, Tesla 2. Medium damage to enemies in the room. 41 damage. That's pretty good. What's my current? The current is 35, so it'd just be a flat bonus. Or the viral injector. Um. I'm gonna go for Tesla 2. And then run her back. Trying to keep an eye on everybody's health. Her health is halfway down. Oh, I should probably be powering up some of this stuff, huh? Just because I have the power. I have the power. It's a knife. I don't have anybody that uses knives, but I'll try for the uh, second unknown. First aid kit. HP regen of 6. Unlocks placebo. Uh, does anybody have an empty slot? No. Uh, 
he gets bonus for enemies in the room. I think I'm going to switch that out so that now she gets HP regen of 10 in a powered room. Nice. Plus the, the 6 that it normally gives her. And now she's got her speed back. So I just have to uh, run her back into powered rooms. Wow, those guys are fast too. Nice, nice. What are you working on again? You're working on that. Oh, and you're working on that other one. No other enemy showed up, so I'll go see what this merchant has. Uh, he's selling things based on science. Um, I'm going to sell off this gun that I can't use. The 99 gig eviscerator. Lowered speed, 34 attack power. Would it be better than the thing he's got? Two, negative 2, 24.2, negative 2, yeah, that would be better than I've got. 51 science, I can swing that. Buy that, and then, uh, where is he? Put that on there. Nice. Ah, uh, you retard. Uh, you talk to her, him again. So. There we go. Kind of evened everything out. Should be good now. Um, he would get a second level of his fire damage. I'll do that. You would get just straight bonuses to things same as you same as you hmm. would you gain any speed probably not no no speed at all I think I'll save the rest because I think we're getting to a point where the enemies will be dangerous enough that it's worth uh Two doors left. Two doors I can see, right? Yeah, one there, one there. I have a feeling I'm not going to have enough for another couple doors, so I'm not going to bother. Oh, no, get back in here. That's a lot of dudes. Gotta keep an eye on those health bars. Okay. Nice. Um, the last door. Or the last door that I can see. There's a door after it. Good. Okay. Golgi. Another character. I'm going to ignore them because I like the people I currently have. Uh, and I see no enemies showing up. So, put some power there. Put some power there. Alright. You and you go to the exit. You go to the crystal room. I think it's time for you. Yeah, also go to the crystal room. All right. 
go, uh, go, uh, whatever your name is, we'll make it. So yeah, enemies are in there, and in there, and in there, and then Death Merchant. Yeah, I'm definitely going to make it in time. You can see in there, NPCs you do not recruit will still uh, get into combat. What just did that? What just went... I don't know. Anyway, four heroes in the elevator, and off we go. I haven't had this much fun in an elevator since that pallet of lubricant. Ah, forget it. Now the good news is, uh, well, I mean, I've made it for another floor, but I also now have unlocked Opbot DV8 as a permanent character, which is good for future runs, even though the other three guys are sadly ones I've already had before. But now that uh, the floor is done, it is time to end the video. So as always, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.